Ken Surfs here with another shave video. Well, I'm going to uh, be trying for the first time uh, some items that came in the mail a couple of weeks ago. And I want to say thanks again to David. He had ordered them from Shave Revolution, uh, sent them from Shave Revolution. And uh, what I'm going to try today, which just smells amazing, it's from Beaver Woodwright and it is Shipwreck Cove. And I'm telling you, it just smells fantastic. I opened it up earlier, and uh, actually I opened up the aftershave and took a smell, and uh, I, <laughs> oh, it still smells fantastic. And we've got the Shipwreck Cove uh, from Beaver Woodwright aftershave along with that. So I'm gonna try this out for the first time today, and I'm telling you, it really, really smells good. I wanna say thanks again, David, for sending this. It's, a, it's great trying out new items, it really is. So what I will be using on this is an old item. I'm going to use my uh, 34G Mercure, and I will use a Wilkinson Sword Blade with that. And uh, I will be doing the uh, Pro Rosso Pre-Shave, and I'm gonna use the Shave Mac uh, uh, Badger Brush uh, that I got from Germany a little while ago, and it's just fantastic. So let me get that all ready, and uh, we'll get started. All right. It, smells great and it is lathering up good and there's that really cool shave mac brush that uh, i just love the design of that handle and it is lathering up great it smells great i've already got the parasso on so let's give it a go <laughs> right off the bat perfect Still can't get over the weekend. Had a great time at that Riverside meetup. And I know I've been reading my comments and there's a lot of meetups going all going on all over the place. And I believe there's one in Houston coming up. And uh, good luck at that one. That, that sounds like it'll be fun. I'd like to hear how it went. I think there's one in Portland or Seattle coming up. Hey, they have them all over, which is great. Wish I could go to them all. I will be doing a video in a couple of weeks, and uh, it's going to be one of those on-the-road videos, like, you know, when I go to Vegas or I go someplace, and uh, I've never been to this place before, and it's been the subject of a conspiracy theory since November 22nd, 1963. So I'm going to go check out uh, this location, take some nice video, and then have an awesome shave that night. I'm gonna go visit my uh, daughter and my new son-in-law uh, out there and uh, see you in the comments if you can guess where I'm going. All right, let's try this. I like to do other videos sometimes, not just with shaving. You've probably seen them, knives, uh, pinball machines, and you get a lot of comments. I did one on the Playboy pinball machine from 1978 and someone was saying, that's kind of sexist. Why do you have that in the man cave? Well, you know, can't please everyone. I did do a video the other day. In fact, I should give an, a disclaimer. Uh, somebody had commented, what's a grown man doing playing Pokemon 2 on his iPhone? And uh, he's probably right. Let me tell you the downfall to uh, playing that game. In Huntington Beach, down by the pier, down on Main Street, they have a dozen nightclubs, bars, nightclubs. And I don't know if it's on purpose or they paid for it, but there's intentional uh, game stops for that game placed out at every single bar on Main Street there. And if you go to those bars, and you bring your phone in the evening and you're playing that game, you are going to get to your table, drunk, scantily clad women coming over, asking what's going on because they're playing the game too. So nobody wants to be bothered by scantily clad, half naked, drunk women at a bar, do you? So there are some uh, funny perks to playing that game. I'll let you decide. Just don't go with your wife or girlfriend.
Man, this soap really, really feels good. And you can't go wrong with these 34 razors. Uh, you know, they just shave so fantastic, these Mercures. And I really like the gold look. And that was a gift from my wife. Or my father-in-law. It's a Christmas present. Oops. All right. Pass one went really well. I also did a video, now that I'm remembering some of the comments, I have a 2012 Dodge Challenger, and I took it to the racetrack, drag raced it, and a gentleman, I guess he was a Prius owner, no offense, you know, you're doing great for the environment, commented that he gets 50 miles per gallon plus in his Prius, and what does a guy getting a Challenger get? Laid. Yeah, I grew up with muscle cars all through high school, college. They used to be plentiful here in the U.S. Challengers, Chargers, Camaros, Corvettes. Now uh, rich people all over the world, Australia, New Zealand, Germany. They're buying them up from the U.S., Japan, and having them shipped out of the country. They're loading docks up in the port of Long Beach loaded with antique vintage cars from the 60s, 50s, 70s. Ah, it's a shame, we're never gonna see them on the streets out here again, but you'll get to see them in your countries. My brother had a 65 Mustang convertible, sold it about, had to be 20 years ago. A gentleman from Australia came up to a car show, like a swap meet where you go to sell your car and everything, uh, paid cash, brought it to the dock, packaged it up, put it on, Australia. So if you're in Australia and you see a dark blue convertible 65 Mustang driving a by, there's a good chance it came from my brother. All right, let's see how this goes. lost the uh, Allen block again. One sec. My place is so organized now with all these cabinets and drawers. They're hiding in plain sight. Gentleman John. I've had about seven coffees today, so I'm talking a little. You know why. I was in meetings all day at work. Needed to stay awake. Nothing worse than a bunch of engineers talking for hours. All right. All right. Here's the part I've been waiting for. Oh, man. That smells fantastic. Oh, nice burn, too. Love it. Oh, man, that is nice and strong. I hope it lasts. A lot of the aftershaves you put on, and maybe in about an hour or so, they dissipate. I kind of like it when they last a little longer. Very nice. Well, you're seeing it for the first time. Shave soap, aftershave, no nicks. It went perfect. Hey, thanks for watching. I've got a lot of other products to be doing soon, and... Uh, until next time, it's Ken Sir saying have a great evening.